Hello everyone, I'm Kevin with Kevin's RV Tips and Trips. Well, today's the day. We're about to embark on our trip to Ocean Lakes Family Campground for a few days. Now, if you've never been to Ocean Lakes Family Campground, boy, are you in for a treat. As we ride around the campground, we're gonna take and film different locations in that campground to give you a general idea of what to look at and what to look for, and to give you the option if you want to go down to this campground. It is considered the largest campground on the East Coast with over, well over 800, close to 900 campsites and well over 300 rental spots. It's got a water park. They've got their own post office. They've got their own food. It's just a wonderful place. A great family atmosphere for everyone. But before we go, today is 9-11. So many brave men and women gave their life in 2001 when our country came under attack by terrorists and cowards. So, as you go through your day today, please let us not forget those brave men and women. So on a happier note, come along with us as we take off to Ocean Lakes Family Campground. See you there. Concerts and stuff, and here's your laundry mat. Sandy soapy suds. Here's a very popular spot where everybody can take and get their photo with Sandy the starfish. And off top of lakes and things around in the campground. There's about eight lakes on this property. Very 
stuff for them last night, a lot of rain. Um, right here on the right is the uh, Ocean Lakes Water Park. It's a pretty popular place. Um, since Labor Day is over. I think later on today you're going to open all this back up. It was open yesterday. That water slide's awesome. Constantly working in here, getting things done. Sandy Harbor. Awesome place. We'll get some more video of it today. Baby, they open it back up. We've been opening up on Saturdays, opening up the water slide. It's not open during the week now because Labor Day is over. Summer's officially over, but they are going to open it up right here through October. This is the uh, Arcade Center. A lot of, uh, lot of stuff to do in there. This is the Recreation Center. People can come in and um, they do different um, different things in there. Um, they hold these big bluegrass festivals down here. And uh, they have some really big names to come in here and, and uh, play. Beautiful lake out here. One of many, about eight lakes. Back to my right here, lots of more rental properties. Food down here at Ocean Lakes Family Campground. Down here is a very popular area. This is where a lot of the um, recreational stuff is um, volleyball court. Basketball court here on the uh, left. Very popular. People are down here usually late at night playing basketball. As you can tell, they're hurricane proof because it's just over that boom is the, is the Atlantic Ocean. So they're literally right on the water. Awesome place. Got a whole section of cornhole. Picnic tables. If you can't find something to do at Ocean Lake Campground, then there's a problem. Another small area for the kids to play. There's another section back here at Ocean Lake's down the campground that I wanted to show you. Um, this is a uh, this is behind the uh, food center, the meat and eat. Um, but there is a nature center behind the 
Eaton Meat. And at the Nature Center, they have some reptiles on the inside. And they have a lot of nautical history in the Nature Center. And it appears to be closed right now, probably due to the COVID. Uh, but inside here, um, also gives a uh, lot of history about Ocean Lakes Campground and their founders and how Ocean Lakes evolved and it will give you the full history on Ocean Lakes. Very interesting place to come and see and it's, like I said, it's back behind the, uh, the uh, meat neat and um, there's recycling centers. Um, there's all kind of stuff back here. Um, it's just kind of hidden and kind of tucked away but it's a a lot, of, a lot of deliveries are made back here, and um, but this is um, there's some residential stuff up in here too. I imagine probably some of the owners and some of the other folks that are alive. golf cart rental place. Um, that's the main office right here coming in. Um, there is a um, security down here. Uh, they also have RV sales. This is the uh, golf cart sales and service. They also sell golf carts here. And um, we better get over on the road or I'm going to get killed. RV center. They sell the RVs at. It's the main security office to the end. If you need, uh, need anything, there's just a lot of different places out here that you can uh, be. This is like an overflow for the golf carts. Another popular spot down here is the uh, the uh, uh, area. Under this, there's a uh, skate place for skateboarders. They have a full, full scale skateboard section down on the bottom of this. It's the uh, top of Sandy's down under. Um, they have a little snack shop here. A lot of times it's not even open. I think they usually open it up mainly in the, uh, in the uh, summertime and the heat. Um, place the coverage probably got all that jacked up. So, this area here is the uh, area behind it, next to the water. Everybody comes through here at night time with golf carts, and they have a golf cart parade pretty much every night through here. And people just drag this area with golf carts and just ride, ride, ride all night long, up until about 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock is quiet hours. So, um, it's a neat place. You get to see all kinds of stuff. Um, all kind of different types of campers and motor homes in here. Just an awesome place. Awesome. Give you a little peek at our campsite. Um, this is where we're set up at. 4167. It's right behind the post office. Um, Got us a couple of golf carts. Um, got our little area set up. We got the um, got us a tent for the uh, older boys. Got all the 